What's up guys, Gabe here from Our Simple Story. In this quick video, we're gonna take you to the Soto National Memorial, take you on inside and give you a quick tour and talk to you about why you wanna stop in this place. Stick around, and enjoy the video. Located at 8300 DeSoto Memorial Highway, Bradenton, Florida, DeSoto National Memorial commemorates the 1539 landing of Hernando de Soto and the first extensive organized exploration by Europeans of what is now the southern United States. In May of 1539, Hernando de Soto and an army of over 600 soldiers landed in the Tampa Bay area. They arrived in nine ships laden with supplies, 220 horses, a herd of pigs, war dogs, cannons, matchlock muskets, armor, tools, and rations. They were executing the order of King Charles V to sail to La Florida and conquer, populate, and pacify the land. The National Memorial was authorized on March 11, 1948. As with all historic areas administered by the National Park Service, the memorial was listed on the National Register of Historic Places on October 15, 1966, with the name Shaw's Point Archaeological District. The mission of DeSoto National Memorial is to preserve the controversial story of this exploration and interpret its significance in American history. Visitors can attend living history demonstrations, try on a piece of armor, or walk the nature trail through a Florida coastal landscape similar to the one encountered by the conquistadors almost 500 years ago. It's like a little blacksmith shop. What's in here? Ooh. It's all locked up. Darn. You going that way? You are not permitted. Many moons ago, Stacy and I came here when we were just boyfriend and girlfriend. And I'm gonna try to find that photo and put it over the video now of younger us when they were doing the reenactment there in the little Spanish village. Pretty cool. But here's the beach. This is a nice part, huh? It's Emerson Point out that way. There's the big Indian mound out there. Is there any crabs here? Probably. Is it still alive? No. Mm -hmm. During the cooler months, visitors can observe Camp Uzita a living history camp which runs from December through April. The season ends with a reenactment of DeSoto's landing on the beaches of Tampa Bay. Other park activities include nature trails and guided trail walks, fishing, bird watching, and picnicking. Park admission is free. In addition to an interpretive and visitor center, the park offers a couple miles of coastal wetland trails that weave their way through the majestic mangrove trees which form a natural tunnel through which you walk. There are several beach access points along the trails, and the tidal bay waters offer visitors a chance to see native wildlife such as dolphins, horseshoe crabs, hermit crabs, and more. The park takes just a few hours to fully appreciate, and is a great stop on your way out to some of the beaches that Manatee and Sarasota counties have to offer. Well guys, I hope you enjoyed our quick little adventure to DeSoto Landing National Memorial here in Bradenton, Florida. If you don't mind, if we earned it, would you consider giving this video a thumbs up? Subscribe and share this video to help our channel out. We really appreciate it, and we will see you in the next adventure. Keep it real.